All right, so I'm going to be talking about this is undoubtedly the best numbers bait I've ever come across for all situations, all water temperatures, everything. There can be ice on the water. The water can be pretty much boiling. And uh, this thing just always seems to work. The craziest frontal patterns can happen. The only time that I've seen this thing not really work is when the fish are really trying to feed um, in deep water, you know, like big reservoir kind of stuff. And they're feeding out deep in the post-spawn pattern where this, you, you, I mean, you need the bottom and you need shallow water to fish this. But as far as ponds and small lakes, like 300 acres and less, you're not going to get anything better than this. Now, you will not catch big fish on this. This, that's the only dis, you know, this is, that's the only drawback with this lure is that you will not catch big fish on it. The biggest fish I've ever caught on this rig was probably about four, four and a half. And I've never heard of anybody catching up over five and a half pounds on this rig but you will load the boat with a bunch of numbers. I know I go around with uh, this rig all the time to public waters and I'm catching like five or six fish to the average guy's one. And no joke, it's just a crazy numbers bait, even when they're not really biting. It's called a slider head worm. So this is the hook. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure this is a, uh, a one eighth ounce jig head. And you'll just see, you'll go to the store and. Uh, ask for slider head worms uh, and their hooks and this is what they look like and all you're going to do is take a finesse worm just like this I really like the zoom models but you can use anything uh, sometimes I like using uh, curly tails curly tails can work really well but basically just a smaller worm like this and you're in a Texas rig it just like everything I, I use you come down just like that that's for the crook of the hook Oh, kind of tore it a little bit, but that's okay. And then stick it in. Now this is not a skin hook, so what we need to do is we need to give the hook a root to go through the plastic. Just like that. And then pack it through. That way now it's actually got a travel way to go up and through that plastic. But all we're going to do with this guy, this is a pure Texas rig, all we're going to do with this guy is bounce it up off the bottom. I'm just going to sit on the bottom like that. And honestly, I have no idea why it uh, works so well, but it is just absolutely killer no matter what time of year, whether it's ice on the water or whether it's, you know, 90 degree water. This is the best pond lure of all time, and I will stand by that and I will prove it. So, uh, favorite colors for this is green pumpkin. Almost can't go wrong with green pumpkin uh, for any basically pond in the Midwest. It's just, it's just a fantastic lure. But disclaimer, you will not catch giant fish on this. So, hope it helps.